Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your girl Shalisa, and I'm coming back with another video. Um, so in today's video, I'm just doing like a little vlog type thing. I just got home from work. Um, it is currently about four o'clock. I am in my bathroom. Um, TMI, but oh well. And I'm just gonna talk to you guys about this IUD I just got. So, oh my gosh, guys, they did not tell you the pain and the pressure that goes on down there when they put this damn IUD in. I am covered up, so don't feel like, you know, I ain't got no clothes on. But, um, it's a lot of pressure. <laughs> First, I want you guys to check like this video. Comment down below and subscribe. So if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, what are you doing? What are you waiting for? I am the best. So please subscribe because it's free. <laughs> um, yeah, y'all. So I just got this IUD put in. Um, it's a little painful, y'all. All right, y'all. Now that I've set you guys down, I can talk to you guys a little bit better about this whole IUD situation. So... I just left the doctor office and I got the IUD implanted into my cervix. Um, I chose this method because I have a son and he is currently three years old. And at this moment in time, I'm not looking to have any more children. I'm not looking to be a single mom of two right now. I am, that is shut down right now. Me and his dad are not together, so I'm not in the search of finding the man to have a baby with right now. Now, I'm not giving up on love. I may find someone in my future, hopefully a husband or a man who wants kids, who wants to stay with your girl, and we can have a baby. But as of today, in 2020, in April, I don't want no more children. So I chose IUD. And I like I said, I just left. So I've got home. So I've been home about an hour now. And gosh, guys, I can feel it. <laughs> Man, I have a lot of pressure down there. Um, a lot of pressure. Not like pregnancy pressure, but like pressure on my stomach where I can feel that they were in they were pushing down on my uterus and stuff oh my gosh guys I just took a pain pill and man it's painful <laughs> it's I've had a baby guys and I'm saying like it's a little it's a little painful it's not even gonna lie when I had my so I did not think of the pain but man, y'all, damn, this is real pain. I don't know what else to say about it, guys. Like, I guess you have a baby and you decide you don't want one, so you get this IUD and you're in pain as well. Hopefully this pain don't last for long. I'm hoping, like, it's gone within, like, a couple of days. But we're going to have to find out. So you guys stay tuned for another vlog when I tell you the guys that the pain is gone and they don't tell y'all about the smell your little vagina is going to have after the IUD. I'm not, I'm not, whatever they put to clean your cootie cat, they don't tell you about that smell. Girl, it's over here perfuming, but that ain't the point. We're going to talk about something else.
Hi guys. So I just got picked up from my daycare. Well, from his new daycare. And he likes it. He really does. I'm going to show you guys his craft when I get home probably. But he's showing you that one. Um, Say hi. Oh, he got that. So yeah, yeah. I just picked up my little study money money from daycare. Um, how was your day? Good. You had a good day? Yeah. You did? What'd you do? Tell me what you did. Uh -huh. Don't come for me in the comments, y'all, about me driving and um, driving and recording at the same time. Because I'm on a residential street, as you guys can see. So don't come for me in my comment section. All right. Say hi. How was your day? He told me he had a good day. He had Mom, two accidents. Say, I don't know. Well, he had two accidents, but that's okay. That's to be expected. Mommy. But honestly, he is completely, Mommy. pretty much potty trained. Mommy. Yes. Mommy. How many accidents did you have? Huh? So yeah, yeah. We'll see you guys when we get home.